Hello YouTube and welcome to Groundworks Plays Subnautica. Well, my history with this game is a little bit interesting. I have actually bought this game uh, back in the days when it was only a tech demo. I liked the tech demo so much that I subscribed into the game. But for some reason until recently I never played it. I never get to actually, you know, dive in and go and despite the fact that I saw some videos, I saw what people are playing and so on. So, I'm thinking um, now that the game has uh, released, finally, it's time to give it a good look and I I will start a playthrough and then we will see, smash the like button and let me know what you think if you like it. Okay, I have played a little bit, uh, 12 hours, just to get a feeling for how does it go and how does it play, but I didn't want to spoil it too much for myself. So, we will be starting a new game. And originally I've been play wanted to play Freedom, but uh, since I've tried it out a little bit, I saw that the survival actually is quite well balanced, and I think it will be also interesting that we explore it a little bit. So let's go with it. I'm gonna let the game now load and uh, that we go with the initial intro and everything. By the way guys, if you haven't checked this out game on Steam, do check it out. Uh, my impression so far is that the game is everything what No Man's Sky was supposed to be, but it isn't. Press any button to continue. Oops. Uh oh. Oi. Mind the head. Okay, fire. So we need to put it out quickly. Come on, come on. Fire extinguisher and... Yeah. FH to report bugs and give feedback. I will, if I can. Oh! I have an... PDA. Tab to open or close PDA. Yes, I did. Perfect. Voice log. Yeah, okay, this is what uh, she just said. Okay, so we have nothing but a fire extinguisher. And we have just landed on an... I don't think I need a fire extinguisher anymore. I can. Let's climb the ladder, see where we are at. Oh boy. Okay, well, that is our ship, Aurora, I guess. Yeah, beautiful. Okay. Well, we are on this. Uh, so, this is sort of a seaplane. Let's check out what it looks like. Ooh, beautiful. Let's see, what do we do? Hello. I played this a little bit so I know that I can actually go and pick up these couple of things. Uh -huh. Break limestone, okay. Oh, and we got copper. Unlikely but plausible. I love the way... 
Oops, oxygen. Whoa. Yeah, this is, you have to, as you can see, you can have to take care of your health. Oxygen. Oh, we can take some fish. Come on. Fishy. Here, fishy, fishy. Bladder fish. Thank you. Wait, wait, wait. Thank you for telling me that. Can I take these? <coughs> I don't think I can. Okay, well, I don't want to carry this one forever. In my head, hand. Oh, there's this little eye fishies. I'm just gonna take a couple because, yeah, I guess those would be my primary. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. <coughs> right. So I'm holding this fish for a little longer than I would like. Let's go board the escape pod. Okay, so use the fabricator. Resources, basic materials. So basically you're using this kind of fabricator to craft all kinds of wonderful things. Oh, I can craft a battery, what do you know? Water. By the way, this fish that I'm just holding in my hand, you can actually create to make water for yourself. And uh, other fish you can actually just cook, so you can make some cooked food. You could also make cured food. Nice. Personal tools. I knew we could construct an air bladder. I think the first thing that I want to do is I want to tool up. So let's just... Hold on. Water. Drink some. First aid kit. And cooked boomerang. I have another boomerang. I could actually, you know, grill it. <laughs> so. That should fix the old meter. The old food meter. Okay. Good. Storage container. What do we have here? Nutrient blocks and some water. Okay, nice. Let's for the time being dump this and fire extinguisher. I don't think I really need. So blueprints. What do we have? Titanium ingot, glass, bleach, copper wire, battery chip, computer kit. Okay, these are good for cooking apparently and okay, I need standard O2 tank fins pipe uh, I think I want to craft this O2 tank and uh, I think if I take titanium it said that I could craft an O2 tank after all that's something we really do need I mean if we'll be diving new blueprint synthesize High capacity O2 tank? There is something more. Glass, titanium, silver ore. Okay, that's doable. Silicone rubber. Yeah, okay, these are all what we read. Fine. And an air bladder. Okay. I think let's go exploring a little bit more. Okay, so... Let's see. Oh, hello. Titanium. Yes. So you have to get in these outcrops and chop them up and then you can actually get some resources. Okay. Metal salvage. Some more metal salvage. Ooh, what is down there? Looks fun. Creep vine. I, I wonder if we can actually pick up a couple of these. New blueprint, New blueprint acquired. Thank you. Right now I'm just exploring my surrounding area a little bit. 
and picking up some, you know. Ooh, shoot, 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 shoot. You know, this is the downside of you having played for a little bit, is that you're used to having enough oxygen. I have to get used to not having enough oxygen. What is down there? Salt deposit. Okay, cool. What else do we have? This is also salt. Metal salvage. And we have this bladder fishy. Bladder fish, thank you. Yeah, I just like swimming with you, you know, together. Thanks for the heads up. 30 seconds of oxygen. So, might as well swim up. We were actually quite uh, deep down. Okay, what do we need? We want to make the scanner. We need a battery and titanium. We want to make the repair tool. Cave sulfur silicone rubber. Survival knife silicone rubber. Battery and glass. Okay, so we want to be... Since we just started, we want to be tooling up. So... We do want to have some tools. Now, let's see. Ah, there are some quartz. Perfect. Yeah, you need sulfur in order to craft things. Oops! I think sulfur is close when they started to shoot. Ow! There's cave sulfur. Run! I really have a strong distaste for these fishies. Okay, I think 30 seconds of oxygen. I don't want to choke, so might as well hurry up. And it's dark time. Deep breath. Now, what else do we have? I took the bladder fishy. Might as well take one of these. What's your name, buddy? Come on, come on. Come on. Boomerang, okay. Well, Mr. Boomerang, today is your lucky day. You're about to become food. Right, let's see what can we do build now on. Okay. Oh, this is actually... So, first things first, I want to build titanium. Because that takes the most space. This, that we use for metal salvage. Okay, silicone rubber. Uh some glass lubricant so electronics we said we wanted battery because I think we will need it for the scanner new blueprint synthesized power cell so tools we can do the scanner a knife silicon rubber titanium okay so scanner we will do first then we will do make the repair tool. Then the survival knife. What else do we have? Yeah, yeah. Fins, I need the silicone rubber for that. Can we craft some more silicone rubber? Yes, we can. Okay, so uh, let me just fix use the repair tool so now we have repair tool I'm gonna put the knife to two scanner to one repair tool to three right so let's first repair this stuff 
I don't like the dark and the smoke. Perfect. I knew you could do it. We will be checking the situation. Category 3 Ocean Planet, Oxygen, Nitrogen, Biodiversity, Leviathan Class Predators. Yeah, I don't want to see them just yet. Inventory, med kit. We could actually drink it. Blueprints. Okay, we did this. We did this. Flashlight. We need. And then survival knife, air bladder, and habitat builder. Well, Habitat Builder, I might want, because Habitat Builder can make you start designing your own base. And I would like to move away from this pod as much as quickly as possible. Yeah, increased radiation levels, I think that's Aurora's fault. So, oh, we can actually repair this as well. Fixed. Play message. Oh, it's an answering machine. That doesn't sound too great. Basic materials, personal tools. We need wiring kit and computer chip. For wiring kit, we need what? Silver ore, that we don't have yet. And for the computer chip, table coral sample, copper wire and gold. Gold we have, copper wire, and table coral sample okay and then we then it comes to food i don't want to craft everything just yet so water that's always a need cooked food good ar eating around the fence love the tooltips really okay so i'm thinking that I'm gonna drink you, drink you, eat you, and I'm gonna park the rest of my findings here. And battery. Yes, I have only these three tools. It will actually help me to better correct. What do I need for a high oxygen tank? Hold on. glass titanium silver ore I don't think I have silver ore yet we want to up our capacity in terms of ability to be underwater so yes escape pod okay so we should look for what do we need to look for I forgot Jeez. bravo ground forks table coral copper and silver. Table coral, copper and silver. Table, co table coral is actually quite easy. You just take some. And while we have the scanner we actually might want to scan everything. Table coral. Indigenous life form. Each disk, colony of microorganisms, blah blah, exploitable in computer chip fabrication. Perfect. So we'll need that for the computer chip. Let's just scan what do we have here. Acid mushroom. Common spore, bear, fungi sample. Oh, swim to the surface. Yes, of course. Okay, Within, writhing need, or writhing weed, sorry. What else do we have? Decoration, fine. Self-scan, we can self-scan, okay, perfect. Self 
Okay, come here. I want to scan you, fishy. Come on, bladderfish. Semi permeable bladder, open ended vascular tubing, edible oxygen. Yes, perfect. Scan the boomerang. I, I know you're tasty. I just want to scan you. Oh, I might want to eat you as well. Uh, okay, Doki, what do we have here? Some mushroom? Or. Now, copper. We said we need copper. We said we need silver and uh, to build this. Copper, silver and table coral we have. Okay. Now let's go check what we have down. I think I saw something interesting down there. I did. And that's these box. Here is, by the way, place. Oh, sea glide fragment. By scanning these guys, you actually unlock different technologies. And this is why this is beautiful because this game is a sort of an exploration game. Creep vine. Let's let's take some sample. New blueprint synthesized from resource. Fiber mesh. I think I will need a couple of these, so might as well, because these are huge. Yeah. Okay. Let's see what else do we have. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Thanks for reminding me. Oh, there's a wreck over there. Hello. Who are you? Floater. What's your purpose in life? May aid flow in the flotation of sunken objects. I'm gonna pick one of you. All right. Blue palm. Oh, look, you look beautiful. Do you have any other use? Let's find out. Nah. Not really useful. Okay. There is a wreck. Which definitely looks interesting. But first, I need to get some air. Right, let's scan and see what can we pick up. To see all that we can see. Cargo. This one is closed. Oh, sea glide fragment. New blueprint synthesized. Sea glide. Yay. So we can actually now make a sea glide. That will make things a lot easier in terms of exploration. What's that noise? I don't like that noise. It's rumbling. Can we open? Locked? No. Oh, there's something shooting up there. Is it like a gas vent or something? Well, one thing at a time, ground forks. First scan whatever we can scan here. We found the sea glide, which is good. But I have a feeling that we could actually scan some more, you know. Natural curiosity for scanning, it's admirable. How much okay we don't have that much we have to you know concern ourselves with sustenance also come on boomerang come over here oh look and it knocked out oh ow, 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 ow. hot 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 okay that was not a prudent idea not to myself don't do it again oh and you're a peeper so I scan the mr. peeper indigenous life form peeper I know that those are tasty. What does it say? Peeper. Well, blueprints. Cured peeper. Nice. Oops. Oxygen. Man. I suck at this oxygen thingy. I should craft. I need to find silver, if I remember correctly. 
silver and more copper so let's so I guess we need to look for these outcrops and stuff let's see what are you titanium perfect metal salvage yes please limestone chunk copper Sandstone chunk. Silver ore. Yes, please. That's what I need. Okay, so I need sandstone chunks for the for the silver. Good to know. Titanium. Either somebody is very hungry or somebody has really, really you know empty stomach in which case I don't want to be around that thing okay metal salvage right now we are just skirting around this thing giant coral tubes anything to pick up here nope <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Hmm. Oh, there is a radio message. Apparently. I'm just doing a circle. Creepvine. There is some more metal salvage to be found. There are these chunks again. Copper. Definitely gonna be useful. Inventory full. Oh, guess. Okay, I guess I should return. Unless you turn out to be something really cool. What is this? Oh, that's a salt. Man, there's more salt here than on Reddit. Don't believe it. There is some quartz to be found over there. Let's get back. I think if we craft sea glide, it was gonna help us a lot. Hello, peeper. First things first. Who called? This is Life Pod 3 uploading our coordinates. We're plugging some holes in our emergency sea glide, so if we're late for the rendezvous, don't panic. Also, don't go home without us. Seriously. Three out. <laughs> Just smelting some titanium. Titanium fiber mesh. Copper wire. As far as I recall, we will need it. Um, sustenance. Let's get rid of the fish first. Cooked peeper. I. Yes, yes, yes. So it basically cleans the fish and grills it for you. Oh, no, 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 no. I want the water from you. Right. Equipment. What can I do? I need two glass. Oh, I just need two glass. Well, I think that's craftable, actually. Two glass. Uh, to craft the glass, I need quartz, as far as I remember. So if I take two quarts and if I eat those two and eat that one and eat that one, I'll be perfectly healthy and happy. So equipment, I need to make some more glass. Thank you. I mean, this is the first episode, so of course we are a little bit tooling up. And I'm guessing I need to take that standard O2 tank here. 
Will that help our situation in terms of high capacity? Oh, we need one more glass. Okay, sorry. One more glass. I need more quartz for that. I have two more quartz. That's good. So we will be able to craft the higher capacity O2 tank. And I think it's kind of important because you see how brief is our escapade underwater. So we need a high capacity O2 tank. I think it will be much better. There we go. 130. Now we're talking. So what else did we say we're, we're going to craft? Rebreather. Conserves oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles CO2 into breathable air. And I need a wiring kit for that. And to do the wiring kit, I need two silver ore. Well, bollocks. I think I only have one silver ore. Or do I? I was pretty sure I got some silver ore. Do I have here? Nope, just quartz and titanium. Well, that sucks. I'm gonna... Well, we, we could do something else. Hold on. No. We were saying sea glide. Pathfinder tool? That could be handy to map the way out of caves. Yes. Habitat builder. Computer chip. And to do the computer chip, we said we needed gold, copper wire, and table coral sample. I think we have some of these. Copper we have, table coral we have, and one gold we have. So we can actually craft that. Computer chip. Copper wire. And then a computer chip. And then we can do the advanced wiring kit. Wonderful. I'm gonna park you just here for now. Uh, and what did, at least did we said we can do for tools? Tools we said uh, we can do wiring kit. For the wiring I need silver ore, yeah, so not, not gonna happen just yet. But uh, sea glide. Battery, lubricant, copper wire, titanium. Battery we have, lubricant we have, copper, we need more copper for the copper wire, and titanium we have. Okay, so what can I do with this creep vine? Yeah, I can actually create a little few more fiber mesh because I don't think I will be needing the creep vine sample for it. Equipment, yes, I've noticed, yes, I've noticed, okay storage container let's just dump these things real quick and I'm gonna take things that will help me sustain myself a little bit longer so the order du jour is copper and silver copper and silver creep wine sample and titanium I could actually make this pathfinder tool five creep wine samples. I'm gonna grab five of them. Ooh, it's night. Thank you. I'm looking forward to the fireworks. Yeah, not really, but... Okay. Life pod 3 shallow screw reported their sea glide is damaged oh who are you are you friendly uh oh doesn't sound friendly one two two three four five is it five come on tell me it's five yes it is five. Uh oh getting out of here How much water we have enough but food well you can never have too little water come here bladder fishy I know from experience that those are sometimes hard to come by so especially if you fish them out like I do Ooh. 
Ooh, and he's green. Uh oh. I'm gonna move away real quick. Peeper, welcome. Now, let's make that Pathfinder tool, shall we? I think it's good in the beginning if you tool up, it becomes easier. Fabricator is dark, I have no idea why is that. So, equipment, tools, Pathfinder tool. In my original playthrough I haven't played it that much, so I don't know what it does, but... Water, yes please. You can never have too much water because, I mean, when you're swimming, your consumption just goes way up. Cured peeper. Yes, I know. Right, so... That was a life pod 3. We should actually go and check it out. But I'm waiting for the daylight to come. Can we do a flashlight? I mean, the flashlight would help our exploring. Battery and glass. I think we do have battery. And uh, if we wanted to craft another battery, how hard is it? Copper and acid mushroom. Copper ore and acid mushroom. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go make a battery. I mean, exploring is not, no point. There we go, two shrooms and and then let's make something, come on. Fabricator. I have no idea why it's this dark. Battery. And do we have enough glass? I'm just wondering. We have one quartz. So we might not have enough. Okay, let's just park then real quick. Water, we are a little bit short on water. Okay, so we drink this. Also clears up our inventory. Composed of multiple organisms in symbiosis. Yeah. Oh well. I could use some more quartz actually. So quartz, copper, silver. <laughs> Funny guy. Ah, there are some more quartz. Just have to be careful on this little pissed fishes which start and then go like, yeah, kamikaze, you know. There she is! Did I piss it off? I didn't. Hey here, fishy, fishy, fishy! Yeah! The problem is that it always hits me. Regardless how fast I tried to run away. What's this? Sandstone? Come on. Lead. Okay, well that's gonna be useful, I assume. I think I came this way. Yeah, I came this way. Then let's try the other way. Oh, and this oxygen tank is already paying for itself. Look, I can dive actually quite long time now. That's beautiful. I think I'm gonna hold off on the titanium for now. I think I need other metals. And let's go check out that life pod, shall we? I need copper and silver. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another one of those kamikaze fishes. Oh, ouch. Those really hurt. Uh, I think I should rather go to the life pod to pick up the med kit because actually despite my best wishes, they have actually hit me quite good. So I need a med kit. Uh, med kit fabricator, thank you. Do we have another med kit here that I could pick up? 
No, we don't. Okay. Let us then continue. Where's that life pod now? There it is. I'm gonna use this giant coral tubes. Oops. I don't really like these stalkers. They're kind of... It's a bit hostile. Come on, I'm also looking while I'm going here for some outcrops. Like this one, for example. And copper ore, see? As you travel, it's good that you utilize your surroundings. Some more limestone? No. Alrighty then. Oops. Stalker. Hi, Stalker. Bye, Stalker. Okay. Let's see. This is actually a beautiful section of the shallows. What is that? Oh, floaters are holding something up in the air. Well, ain't that funny. Oh, I see a limestone chunk. And titanium. Ugh. I was hoping for something more fancy, to be honest. I have to once again be careful about this kamikaze fish. Quartz, yes please. You can... One thing I found, you can never have enough quartz. How much more? 300 meters. They're quite far, you know. Especially if you're swimming on your own. Why did I, don't I have... Oh, I never ate the health kit. Nice job, Gromforks. Oh, there are lots of stones here. Sandstone, silver, yes please. Limestone, copper, yes please. I think I saw, I thought I saw another one. Oh, there you are. Hello. Titanium. Copper, thank you. Titanium, I'm gonna leave it for the time being. I'm not being snobby, I just um, have to be careful about my inventory. Well, some titanium we can take, I mean... Uh, it's better not to discriminate too much. Copper, yes please. Oh, there is, there was something here. Copper. Shallows reported sea glide damage. They're quite far, I can actually. Yeah. Especially given that I don't have my sea glide yet. And I would love to have me some sea glide. But I need lead. Not lead, I need silver for that. And silver, I'm hoping to find some around here so I don't have to go on foot. Or actually, on foot might not be the best term here. Titanium. Well, there they are. Let's let's hope they we get something good. Oh, and there's a stalker here. Hi, beautiful. Stop eating me, please. He just takes a nibble. He's not that scary. There are much scarier things around here. Or actually, for drought. Sea glide fragment. I think it's called free titanium at this point. Move. Yeah. Good thing I have a knife. Oh, now let's see what we have here. We have a ban abandoned PDA. Seeing the map, we'll be terrified. 
Wonderful, thank you. Thanks for the vote of confidence. I think I should be going that way. And the compass we can actually also make. That will be handy for us to know the orientation because I can I can get lost very easily here. Creep vine. I'm just looking for some more sandstone outcrops. Come on. How much inventory do we have? Pretty packed up. Okay, let's see if there's something to be scanned here. Oh, there is. Perfect. Metal salvage. Not yet. Thank you. However, I will go and I will scan this. Trash can. I assume that would be a base piece. Trash can. Thank you. Grab trap. Okay, these are actually quite handy for fishing. Okay, move, 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 move. And actually, I think this is a beacon. Yeah, it is. I need one more. Oh, there's another grab trap. Perfect. Grab trap is actually very good. I wish I could find another beacon if possible. I think there's one there. Yeah. Because beacon are handy for marking the location of the crash sites and everything. So those are super useful later on. Sea glide, that's called free titanium. I think it's always worth to check this because you never know what you might find here. I think I'm gonna need some air. Ooh, come on little bit more air please okay it's getting darker ish so I don't want to overstay my welcome what is this sea glide is there I thought I saw another box over here yeah there it is sea glide as well Okay, never mind. I want to be going slowly back towards our base. Darkness, not winter, is coming. Oh, and there is another air vent or thermal vent. Copper, some eggs. Think I'm gonna pass for the time being. By the way, guys, audio is little uh, plays a big role here at this game, so that's why you can see the environmentals I've cranked up a little bit. Are you gonna fart? Yeah, he did. Oh, disgusting. So let's see. If we get more chunks here limestone I don't think I have yet enough silver but hey that's life titanium where is my where's my life pod Hello. Ah, there you are. So easy to get lost here. Limestone chunk. Titanium. Ah. Quartz. Yes, please. Limestone. Copper. Yes, please. Mushroom. No, not you again. Ow. And he killed me. Balls. What did I lose? A hefty size of my booty. So, can I actually craft a compass? What do I need for crafting a compass? Copper wire wiring kit. Everything needs this bloody silver. So, now I have no idea 
Hold on. If this is here, and Aurora is over, over there, that means that I went this way, somewhere. Damn it, this fish, man. It costed me quite a lot. Uh, now I have to reharvest some more things. Let's see, limestone. And there were like three sandstones, gold, come on. No shit, Sherlock. Yeah. Lead. Silver, yes please. Come on, give me more silver. More silver, please. Water-wise, how am I doing? Fine. Old cook peeper and some food. Thank you. Copper. That really sucks. Once you actually die, you have to reharvest. Sea glide. Titanium. Creep vine. I think that this area is rich, rich with uh, those chunks. So I'm gonna harvest a little gold. Come on, one more silver. That's all I'm asking. I need one more silver and then I'll be happy. Lead. You ask for silver, you get lead. That's the way it usually goes. No. Is that another outcrop? Yes. Copper? Yes, please. Oh, fireworks. Goody. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Anything interesting to scan here? Mo mobile vehicle bay. Ooh. Yes, please. Where is that? Aha, uh -huh, okay. So that side. Oh, bugger off. And these actually creep vines are kind of handy because they illuminate the surrounding area. I'm worried that if I get some more quartz, that fish is gonna be at me again. And I don't see Jack here. So... I might be happy with just what I took. After all, I do have one silver that I would prefer not to lose if possible. Oh, sandstone. Come on. Silver. Yes. Ow. Of course you had to take a nibble and grit. You filthy, filthy fish. Okay. Right, now I think I can actually st start constructing our sea glide. Let's see. It will be handy because it also has a flashlight. So what do we need for the sea glide? Blueprints. Talk to me. Beacon? Yes, we'll use it. Grav trap, we will use it for sure, but sea glide first. Battery, lubricant, copper wire, titanium. So. Lubricant, battery, copper wire, and titanium. We just need to make copper wire and then we will have the sea glide. Copper wire. Okay, and uh, we should be able to make a sea glide. Yes, please. 
Okay, that's very important. Beacon copper or titanium, battery copper or titanium. I'm gonna make one beacon. Do we have enough for another one? Copper ore and titanium, battery copper ore and titanium. Let's see, just battery. We don't have copper ore anymore. Well, let's make a wiring kit that I know that we can make and we need it. I remember we needed it for something. Tools, was it the habitat builder? Wiring kit, computer, chip and battery. I think we can actually make that one. Wiring kit, computer, chip, battery. Yeah, let's make that one. Oh, that will be wonderful. Tools, habitat builder, yay! Okay, that would be beautiful because that could mean that I can actually start working towards our base. What I can I make from compass, copper wire and wiring kit. I don't think I have any of those. Cure food, yeah, I know. Okay, so med kit first. I always have to take one with me because reasons. Uh, so fabricator you're going here titanium glass and lead I will need some a little bit of quartz gold I don't think I'll need silver I don't think I'll need I do want to construct it when it's daytime though although we should give our sea glide a spin, don't you think? Let's see. There we go. Oh, and sunlight is coming up. Beautiful. I want to go this way-ish, kinda. Let's find a good spot for our base. Oh, now that's the way to travel. Ooh, fun stuff. Oh. Oh, that's nice. Beacon. I think I'm gonna drop that one. What do we have here? So, let's put the beacon here. Cave entrance. Cave entrance, I think. Good. Pick up. Pick up some more lead. Cannot hurt, after all. Actually, guys, I think that might be a good location for a base here. Flat area. On the verge of the deep, between the shallows and the deep not too far from our initial pod yeah i'm actually thinking i'll construct the base here sort of here ish cave entrance is over there i wanted to have a beautiful view over this lush area but i also want it to be possible to come here so let's uh, how much materials we have let's just clean up this area metal salvage metal salvage metal salvage and let us just construct the very beginnings of our base here ish 
kinda. Yeah, and here's some table coral. I think this will be a great location for a base. So, foundation. As I said, laying in the foundation. That's one. Oh, I don't have enough lead. I thought I had enough lead. I don't have enough lead. Go figure. Yeah, well, let's go and grab it. And I think I just want to be very basic about the base for the time being. And the good thing is that the beacon will be also pointing us in the right direction in terms of Hold on, uh, lead, yes, and uh, I could use, I could leave you, and I could use some glass, I assume, a bunch more titanium, I'm guessing, and I'm gonna be using titanium. Quite a bit, so. And that's the second reason, because now I have started to amass a lot of, you know, titanium and stuff, and I really want to have a base to store it rather than... And look, it's pointing us to our base, because the cave entrance is over there. Yeah, I think our base being here will be actually quite nice. Once again... I hate these fishes. Right. Now, the way I see it, let's put an eye compartment. I want the, an entrance to be where? I want the entrance to be Mm. I'm not sure, but uh, for the time being, let's construct it over here. Something like that. Little suspended because I plan to put here other things as well. Multi-purpose room, ingredients unknown. Oh, balls. Eyeglass compartment. Well, I at least need one more. If I'm gonna do anything. Do I have two glass? No, I have one glass. And I need a hatch. Hold on. I need to first construct a hatch for the base. And I do that. Quartz and titanium. Yes. Right, then I'm gonna be putting a tea compartment. Ooh, oxygen. There we go. I do want to put another eye compartment here. Something like that. And that will suffice for the time being. Like I said, extremely basic, but it serves it serves a very real purpose. And that's the interior module holding some lockers. And it's here that I can dump most of the things. I might deconstruct them later, but let's just put like here metals Ooh. I'm probably the only idiot who wants to see it close party 
party! Kaboom! Now that's a big bang. We need a radiation suit. And I could have actually used now that lead. Creep line, creep line, come on, give me some sandstone chunk. I need the lead. Come on, give me some now. Silver. Ha! Go figure. Always the other one. Yeah. Oops. He is really angry guy. You should work on your manners. Sea glide. That's some titanium, but we now have space to put it, so that's good. That's the whole reason why I start building the base this early. Oh, sandstone. Lead, yes please. Metal salvage, metal salvage, inventory full. Okay. Right. I think we should go now and start moving things in the base but I guess I will be doing that more in the next episode because we have already reached one hour and six minutes you know time goes fast when you're having fun and we have equipped ourselves pretty nice I mean let me know what you think I'm um, this was the first episode so it was a little bit longer sorry for that next one will be uh, I'll try to stick to a 30 minute format sort of Fabricator. Now, what can you craft? The radiation suit, fiber mesh, and two lead. Oh boy. Fiber mesh, I have. Lead, well, yeah. I'm not too healthy in that department. Some water, cook boomerang. I could actually make some more water if I need to, but I think I'm gonna be okay. Silver. Let's smelt this first. Resources. Titanium. And glass I don't want because I might need quartz. Water. I need the water here. Perfect. So, radiation suit I will need. I just don't need it right now. However, let's... Uh, yeah, we'll be moving everything, like I said, in the next episode. But until then, thank you very much for watching. Like if you like. And this is Grumfork signing off.